Hey, what's going on, people? How are is everybody doing? Um, I'm gonna make a little tutorial here with uh, using the Wave Three dual PC setup. I had some issues, so maybe some of you guys did too. Um, yeah. So let me. Um, yeah. Let's. Uh, I guess get into it here, and uh, uh, yeah. Um. All right, guys. Um, so as you can see, this is like you've already got your your wave three and all that, or wave one. You've already went to Elgato, downloaded that, and you're like, "What the hell? What do I do now?" Because I'm not getting it to the dual PC setup. Um, you know, for me, it took me a little while just to uh, figure it out, and I was like, Man, "What's what is the deal?" You know, and I talked to Elgato and we kind of got it set up and then I changed my boom arm put like a, a boom arm you know I didn't go through Elgato to get that I, I just bought one from like Guitar Center and all that and bought a universal shot mount it works fine with it um, but yeah so first thing is um, if you never used it and you were using the uh, uh, this is primarily for the, um, what is it, HK460 Pro that I have, um, the PCI, but it would be the same if you use, uh, what is it, just the the, the other one, uh, 460 or whatever it is. Um, so normally when you do that, you would run under your, your sound capture. But on this one, you do not want to touch your, your sound capture at all. You want to run everything through the wavelength. So, as you can see, I've got this set up here. So, if you uh, go to your very top screen, just make sure your output is set to uh, the wavelength system. And then whatever uh, microphone you, you're using. Um, I'm using RTX Voice to kind of cut down on the uh, background noise, which I have. Because they have dogs and all that good stuff. So you've got that set up. Um, what you're going to want to do. Is right click on your. Uh, your sound system. You know. Um, go to sound control panel. Right. So then you're going to go to your. Uh, your recording tab. And scroll all the way down to the bottom. You'll see that, that you have that. Um, if you click on it, you know, you go to properties and listen. I don't have that there. I don't have anything checked there. But what you want to do is go look for your wavelength system, right? And you're going to go to your properties on that. Go to listen to. And you're going to want to select your graphics card. This one, you know, is it, you know. You'll, you'll look for this one, the NVIDIA High Definition Audio. So you'll want, you want to make sure that's on, right? And then listen to this device. You want, you want to click that, right? So that, that's enabled. And uh, so that sh that's how you get your sound over to your, uh, to your second PC. But then the, the issue, another issue I was having was I was, uh, I could hear myself when I was talking. So over on your microphone, but here, you, I turn this all the way down. Now, they're supposed to get back with me. You're supposed to be able to turn this off and on, but it doesn't work. <laughs> I can select, you know, if I want to hear what the stream's hitting, I just, you know, select that and I can hear what the stream's, uh, Hitting that. Um, if you're using the RTX voice, another important thing to do is you're going to want to mute these. You don't have to turn them all the way down or anything like that. But if you don't mute them, you're going to get some weird echo in everything. And then everything else, you just, I mean, there's a lot of videos out there how to set up, you know, like your, your browser and, and all that stuff in here when, when you're playing that. And you can link it all to your music and all that good stuff. But um, 
I hope this helps because, like I said, I was struggling with it. I got it in Friday and contacted Elgato, and they, they walked me through it, and I had everything set up. And then all of a sudden, I was getting a, when I changed the, when I unplugged the mic, plugged it back in after I put it on a shock mount and this boom arm, everything went to hell last night. And I contacted Elgato. I didn't get home till probably about a half hour or so before they closed. And they walked me through it. And I still couldn't get it to work. And then I called them back because then I wasn't, we got something fixed. And then I wasn't catch it, capturing anything to the uh, video capture device, which, you know, I just have to rename for for that. But that's what I, I'm, I've got it called on my OBS, on my streaming PC. And then uh, getting a weird echo and all that stuff, got that all taken care of. Then I couldn't hear sound and it, they, you know, he's like, dude, we'll just have to communicate through email, you know, and we'll, we'll figure something out. So then I spent you know, a little bit of time trying to troubleshoot everything. And then I was like, oh, stupid, this is what you did. So in case anybody's looking for a two PC setup for uh, this Elgato Wave, this is what I use. Hopefully this helps. And uh, I hope everybody has a great day and all that good stuff. Um, I'm going to get out of here and try to play some games and stream stuff later on. Audio Jungle.